good to be back. Haven't done a video in a while, but today we have a good one for you. Uh, we are heading down to a famous chicken place called Mary Brown's. Uh, we go there every couple of months because it's a pretty damn good chicken. So today we figured we'd uh, give a nice little drive down to Cornwall, where it's located, and uh, show you guys this little restaurant. It's a little fast to join, but uh, damn good chicken. So we're gonna head down there. It should be, I'm not sure if you can see it, but I'll have an hour and 20 minutes, only because usually it's around an, an hour to get there, but someone had to get some shoes. <laughs> so we took a little detour. Uh, but should be there in about an hour and a half, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll see each other when we get there. person that needed the shoes. <laughs> She's a little shy, uh, camera shy. But to get you soon. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you when I see you in about an hour and a half or so. Just wanted to show you guys the much if you can see how good the sunset is but it's a nice red color hopefully you guys can see it just figured I'd show you that cool thing Everybody, we're about a minute away. Just figured I'd be. We're finally at the place that has delicious chicken. But also remember, there's a place right across the street. I'm not sure if you can see it here, but it. Uh, oh no, maybe you'll be seeing it. Right, but we're here. This is it right here. I'll shut. I'll tell you in a few seconds what I was going to tell you before. And Mary Brown's right here. So there's this place right here. Last year we came for, I think it was last day of summer or last day at least that ice cream place was open. So they gave them a free ice cream. And for good reasons, because it was not good. But uh, it was free pool, a free uh, mini putt and free ice cream. So we took it, but no, it was a good thing it was free. Anyways, here's Mary Brown's. The Mary Brown story started in St. John's, Newfoundland and Labrador in 1969. While much has changed since that time, the brand remains true to its commitment to providing delicious food and genuine hospitality at every visit. It's been like that for way more than 50 years and will always be like that. From three stores in Newfoundland, our reputation for mouth-watering food quickly led to stores opening in Ontario and Alberta. But it wasn't until 2007 that Mary Brown's growth really accelerated. That's when Newfoundland entrepreneur Gregory Roberts acquired the brand. Greg's passion and commitment to excellence led to rapid expansion throughout Canada. In fact, under Greg's leadership, the brand has almost tripled the store count. Today, there are 230 plus stores across Canada with international expansion in the works. Now, back to the video. Hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes, and we finally made it. So we are gonna head inside and uh, eat some good chicken. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so as you can see, problems with my other GoPro here. So we're gonna head in and see Mary Brown's. Let's walk on in. Yeah. 
Knuckle right. Knuckle Muck Hopper. Knuckle Hopper. Because they don't sell it here, but if you want to race it, they're chicken. So, if they don't have, bring your own, I guess. How do you like Mary Brown? Camera shy. How do you like your Mary Brown? <laughs> Before, look at that work of art. I'm not talking about the food, I'm talking about her. As I said before, but I, I didn't say before because it wasn't recording properly. They have good stuff here. This is the chicken that we're dealing with now. There we go. They also have some good macaroni. I'll show you guys. There you go. Freaking delish. It's gonna get better than that. Beats all this crap he has, KFC and all that kind of stuff. This is good. Chicken. Some fries. The environment. Can't go wrong. Almost hot sauce is that good. Dr. Pepper to wash it down. Chicken is with the hands. And that's the chicken breast. Then you use a knife. Love for fried chicken. Always with the knife. With the, with the hands. Is it down a little bit? We got another one over there. Macaroni. <laughs> you know what to hide your illegal rice. <laughs> she destroyed all the evidence. No more rice left. <laughs> I'm going to try out this macaroni. Alright, so this is what happens when you eat yeah. at Mary Brown's. Nothing <laughs> nothing is left over at Mary Brown's. <laughs> it's so good people take takeout. Put that takeout. Yeah. <laughs> we're even doing a TikTok dance while we're doing it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not a thing left. Ding ding tang tang. Don't take it like uh, in a bad way. This is like. Here's my other little one. 
Say hi to the camera. Hello, YouTube. Hello. <laughs> Not to be biased, but you can't find a cuter, cuter baby than that. All right. Party time at Mary Brown's. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we just left that delicious chicken place. Um, an hour and 45 minutes for half an hour of good eating. Uh, so as you can see all my family they ate everything as to what we did so you can tell that's how good it is uh, and also we had a little uh, Tony, Tony, Debbie, we had a little uh, a little party my brother-in-law likes to dance and sing so we had a little nice little party to end the, 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 the evening uh, so now we're gonna head back home it's uh, around 7.53 I'll get home around 9 and then uh, is ready to bed and go to sleep by herself. So, highly recommended place to go. Uh, nice little time to get there, but it's well worth the hour and whatnot to get there. Um, so, uh, that will be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to uh, like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this as it helps uh, build my channel. Uh, so with uh, with that being said, I appreciate you watching my video, taking the time out of your day to watch this video, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Thanks for watching.